Let's take a tour of my account. So from the front of the website, you want to look up in the top right and click on my account. Here, you're going to put in the email address that you gave the library when you registered your card, and then you'll put in your library card number down below, and then click on login. Once you're logged in, you're going to come to your account summary page. At a glance, you can see how many accounts you are linked to, which is how many accounts you have direct control over, items that you would like to check out in the future, access to your checkout history, what items you currently have checked out, items on hold, and your balance. And then down below, you have information about what is the most pressing library news that we have to share with you. Generally, wonderful good things about new services. And then on the right, your upcoming events if you have said that you are going to attend an event or registered for one. Let's look at checkouts and holds. So over on the left, you're going to click on that. Now you're going to see a list of all the items which you have checked out. You'll notice that you have the titles on the left, the due dates in the middle. On the right, it tells you when those items are due. And then if you wanted to renew one of these, you would just click on this little checkbox to the left side, and then at the bottom, click on Renew Select It. Then you get a message that this renewal was successful, so click Close. And then if you look down here on the bottom of the list, it says that this book is now due in 21 days. Next, we're going to go look over at Settings. On your account settings page, you have the options to change your email address. So click on Update Account Information. So you can put an email address and your phone number if you'd like. And then on the right, you can enable your checkout history and account linking. Account linking from this page means, will you allow someone else to link to your account? So if it's on, that means yes, someone else can manage your account. If it's off, no one can manage your account. Then on the right tab, it says linked accounts and it gives you the information about the accounts that you've linked to, the ones you're controlling, and then down below, accounts linking to you, aka who can control your library account. On the left, just go ahead and click through these different tabs, summary, checkouts and holds, find fees and account, wishlist, checkout history, my events, if you'd like to see the other options available.